Hey, welcome back to the channel, guys. So, Battlefront 2 isn't the most well-balanced game. Anybody who plays it can probably agree, and there are certain things in the game that are just way too overpowered. In today's video, we're looking at one of those OP things, and why it's actually banned from tournaments and competitive play. These duels are perfect for the video, since my opponent is using General Grievous and the star card of his that's banned from competition. The Flesh is Weak star card. And these duels should demonstrate why exactly it's banned. So real quick, just to go over what Flesh is Weak actually does, it gives Grievous a 5% damage reduction boost for every 10% of health he's missing. With a health pool of 800, this means Grievous gains 5% reduction for every 80 health he loses, which can seriously add up the more he gets hurt. Oh, I lost track of him. I could have finished it right there. So why is this so powerful? Imagine for a second a Grievous at 400 health, exactly half, at that point, he's taking 25% less damage on every single hit thanks to Flesh's weak. A Grievous at 100 health, he's taking 44% less damage, almost half, meaning he can tank what would otherwise be a finishing blow. The weaker he gets, the harder he gets to kill, and that's why this card is so insanely strong. After all is said and done, it takes about twice as many hits to finish off a Grievous with Flesh than almost any other villain in the game. It's kind of crazy. Now, in this first duel, I'm using Luke Skywalker, and Luke is a pretty good counter to Grievous. You might notice one thing I'm doing every time the Grievous player tries Claw Rush is I'm parrying the rush almost every single time. It doesn't always work, because if you mistime it or if the angle isn't right, he will still knock you. Oh, I've got the timing there, big time. But if you do time it right, you can actually avoid getting knocked by the Claw Rush pretty much the whole time. Again, it doesn't always work, and as you'll see here with this Claw Rush knock counter, uh, I mistimed it several times with one, two, trying a little runaround fake maneuver, but in the end, three knocks and four knocks. This is the duel of hard knocks for sure, and it doesn't help that of course he's using flesh, so I'm just trying to get as much damage into him as possible, but the star card's keeping him alive, and those were all just a result of me mistiming the attack. I still go for it every single time, especially with Luke, because I'm running the star card that gives him damage reduction, so it's a nice little counter. But here we get to finish the duel with two hits off of that exchange, and then we finish it with the rush. Again, it took twice as many hits to finish that Grievous because of flesh, and that's why the card is so damn good. Here we're using Ray for round three, technically. He beat my Ray in the round before with his Darth Maul. But there's the parry on the Claw Rush. We got two clean hits right there, so even Ray can do it. Going for a hook swing. We traded there. Still got the hit into his back, though. Another attempt at a hook. That was a great parry. But that was a really good parry. I recognized it in real time there. Anytime I see a duelist turn around while in the middle of a hook swing and parry the hook, you know they're good. That dash got through and got a lot of damage in there. But look at that, man. He, it looked like he didn't take anything at all. That was three solid hits from dash strike and two follow-up attacks. And he maybe took like 200 damage. 250 at best right here. There's where I normally would overextend when I'm, when I'm down at like 400 some odd health. I'm talking to myself about my Ray play style. That's my biggest weakness with Ray, especially because her health regeneration is so slow. I'll take her, I'll get right here, like 400, 500 ish health, and I'll still try to pressure with my attack, even though I need to back off and let my health recover. That's just a weakness of mine that I'm working on with every single duel. Yeah, this was fun though. I was going to title this video, Watch Out for Low Levels, because this guy, I'm pretty sure was smurfing, because he's playing like this, but his heroes were only level 30. I think the highest level of his I faced was like a 36 or a 37 or something. So if they're playing like this, with levels like that, you know they're good. That rush gets through again. But again, I have to be careful here, I'm just under 200 health. If I pressure too much and he gets big hits in, it's over for me. So I'm just trying to match him step for step here with my dodging. Hit him with the mind trick. It was a fast parry, and I should have had it right here. Oh, saved by the shield. <laughs> Man got saved. It's okay, I get saved by the terrain all the time, so. All's fair in duels and war. And that was me trying to parry the claw rush. Of course, I missed it again. He attacks, he would have got big damage. I dropped my guard, so I got knocked by it, and yeah, I recognized that in real time as well. I was trying a fake, but he was in a perfect position to throw an attack out there, and if he did, he probably would have won the duel. Parried the claw rush once, twice, and uh, he got a little stagger there. 
but I know he's low, so I'm trying to finish it with some hooks, just trying to keep that damage up, but he has, at the very least, 30% damage reduction right now, which makes it difficult. Two hits. Parry on the rush. Another parry on the rush. A third hit out of the rush. We got that knock. Two more hits, and he's still not dead. Like, do you guys understand? Let's go. Aggro Ray. Do you guys see why Flesh is weak is absolutely broken in this game? He should have been dead five minutes ago. This guy's partner is this Kylo Ren. Surprisingly enough, another low level who was actually playing really well. Brought me down to eight health. Eight health. To be fair, I was used to the other guy's timing, so now this guy's throwing in all kinds of weird maneuvers and different timings. That's the downside of dueling multiple people in Showdown, is you get used to one of their timings, and then the other one throws you for a loop. Got that knock, though, with no follow-up. And again, I have to let my health come back. I cannot pressure right now. If this were me playing five months ago, I would have pressured, and I probably would have died because of it. That was a clean turnaround parry. Clean knock. If that second hit got through, I would have won. Just kicked him in the face as he was coming in for the frenzy. That's brutal. Not a bad finish, though, if I say so myself. And the last duel for the video is this man's Grievous one more time, just to demonstrate Flesh is weak, this time against Anakin Skywalker. A big damage light side hero to counteract Grievous' big defense. I went for the pull, but he blocked it. I'm just trying to get some more reads on him. Missed the heroic might. He's blocking steady right here. He goes for the claw rush, and I tried to parry it, but that was a missed time, so he got the knock on me. That was a huge miss time. I should not have jumped right there. Man's got me down to 61, and I've done nothing to him. He's going for some grievous hooks, but missing. Just keeping the defense high. Parry the claw rush. He knocks me the second hit. Unfortunately, I was able to get that pull. Knocked him again with the might, and tried to follow up with two hits. Could only get one in there. All right, gotta love how my parry doesn't go through. <laughs> I think the parry didn't go through because I ran out of stamina. Oi, Chewy. I thought Chewie was being a loser and was trying to hit Grievous, but I think he was just fighting the Kylo on the other end there. Surprisingly enough, he took the Kylo out. Thankfully, he's being cool the rest of the time. Grievous going for some jump attacks. I parried that one, got one hit into his back because of that lucky angle. Knocked him with the might. Knocked him with the pull. Follow up in midair. We're just parrying the claw rush, getting that consistent damage in there, stopping the health recovery. Hit him with the passionate strike. That was a really good sequence. That was big damage. Pretty much even this match out, considering the fact I was at 61. That was clean AF. And we finish it with a clean hook swing. I like that one a lot. But that's the video for today, guys. Thanks a lot for tuning in. Uh, what do you guys think about General Grievous' Flesh is Weak? Do you think it is rightfully banned in tournaments, or do you think it should be allowed? Let me know in the comments below. Personally, I err on the side it should absolutely be banned, and these duels are the reason why. But that's it for today. Thanks for tuning in, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Be sure to like the video and subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you next time. Peace.